What's up everybody? This is going to be your daily tarot insight reading for Monday, August the 27th, 2018. This is a general energy reading, so it may or may not resonate with all who watch. But if you would like a personal reading, you guys can check out in the description box below the link to my website, which is waluchildreadings.com. Just be sure to sign up as a member first if you guys would like to purchase a reading or product from me. Sorry for the shaking. Um, if you guys would like to purchase an instant mini reading with me, you guys can always follow me on Instant Go mobile app. Also, if you guys would like a full and in-depth emergency reading within 24 hours, that's $45, and you'll get it within 24 hours of purchase via PayPal. So I'll leave the information in the description box below for that. Follow me on social media if you would like to as well. Let's go ahead and get into this reading. Okay, so you have Goddess of Beauty. Says you are a wondrous being of light. There is nothing to change or fix. And you have the Eight of Pentacles with the Death card. So what I'm picking up is you guys are very much so putting, I feel the word fix and change. It's funny that that comes out because as you can see, this guy in the Eight of Pentacles, he is definitely working on something. He's fixing something. He's doing some handiwork on this pentacle. The death card symbolizes change and transformation and rebirth. So that energy stands out to me in the card of Goddess of Beauty. So Goddess of Beauty, you know, eyes and beauty is in the eyes of the beholder, as they say. So what I'm picking up is how you're viewing your life. It all depends on your perception how you view yourself maybe physically internally all of that is in your perception her throat chakra has a green flame so i feel like you have to learn to speak lovingly towards yourself you'll see transformation in that and that might be you know you have to work on the internal first before you see the workings of the external and i feel like a lot of you have been doing the works the death card represents the internal since it's the energy of scorpio which is water inner energy, emotions, the depth aspect, the subconscious. With the Eight of Pentacles, this represents the worldly, earthly, material energies, um, and that's the sign of Virgo. And we are actually in the season of Virgo with the Eight of Pentacles being a Virgo card. So all of this energy just lines up. With the butterflies in the card that surround her with these green auras, there's a loving transformation that's taking place as you love yourself, okay? I feel like you're going to see a transformation. You'll see that there's really nothing that you need to change about yourself. This is acceptance of you. It's also an acceptance of the things that are around you. If there's something that does need to change or be fixed for the health or the sake of yourself, being healthy or you know having a healthy self-esteem, not doing it to validate yourself from your ego or to appease others around you, but it's coming from a state of true unconditional love for yourself you're also going to see transformations that could be you know changing your eating habits they could also be changing your lifestyle you know outwardly the things that you don't like such as your job you know maybe leaving behind toxic energies being more confident in yourself being more compassionate for yourself and others actually doing something you love to do there's a transformation there's healing that's taking place you guys might not not necessarily feel it just as yet. You might not feel confident or loving right now within yourself. You might feel like there's so much more that I could do. I'm not happy with who I am. But you guys are very far in that process because you have the Eight of Pentacles. And the next card up is the Nine and it leads to the Ten, which is completion. So you're not far from healing something within yourself that needs to be healed. And we always have work to do on ourselves. So it's never ending. We're always constantly evolving, but I feel like you're on a, a certain journey or path when it comes to how you see yourself and how you see your life, you know. So that is what I'm getting for you guys. I will try to keep up with my dailies this week. I have a lot going on right now. I do need to catch up on bookings. I am a little bit, um, a little bit energetically down right now. So I am working through this energy. So I may or may not always put out my dailies for this week. Um, my weeklies, they may go out or they might be delayed um, or they might not go out. So it just kind of depends on where my energy is. 
I appreciate all of you guys and your love and support. I appreciate the loving vibes that you guys are sending me. And until the next reading, peace.